What up guys, me Carl Franchise here and hello Legends of Tomorrow fans and welcome to my review of Legends of Tomorrow. Yes, Left Behind and yeah, if you haven't seen it yet, go watch it now because it's awesome. Yeah, it is a really, really good episode and fantastic at the same time. But yeah, it's a great, it's a great episode. Amazing, brilliant at the same time. It is really, really good. So good, it's amazing. Yes. Yeah. Basically, yeah. We go, um, yeah, in the episode, yeah, Left Behind, it's um, basically the following events of um, um, episodes um, a Night of the Hawk, yeah. And yeah, it's um but it's Kronos disables the Wave Rider and flees the back to the time stream, taking Snipe Snot with him. Yeah. Hmm. Why you ask? You have to find out what I say. So yeah. Basically, um Ray um Ray um yeah, hold on, guys. Ray and Kendra uh, build the live in 1958, and yeah, they have, they have. And um, Sarah has gone somewhere, gone somewhere to live the life, he, her life. So yeah, basically, yeah, yeah, basically, yeah. It, it was a great episode. I really, really enjoyed it. It was amazing. Awesome. And brilliant at the same time. I loved it. I really, really enjoyed it. It was amazing. So yeah, yeah. Bray and um, Kendra spend the spend the life for two years in um, to uh, 1960. Yeah, 1960s. Yeah, in the 1960. In the year 1960. And yeah, basically. Um, and they and um, and Rip and. Jax and um, uh, and Doctor, uh, so it was. But yeah, it was a really good episode and fantastic at the same time. But yeah, yeah, it was a great episode. I really, really enjoyed it. It was amazing. Yeah. Yes, um, Ray, uh, no, no, um, Rip, um, Rip, Jax, and S S Stein, um, got uh, back, um, went back, um, to 1960 to, um, bring back, um, Ray and, um, Kendra and Sarah, but, here's the thing, she's at N Nanda Park, but, yeah, Nanda Park, but, with Fresh Ogle and Tanya. Argo. Yes, not Nissa Ogo, Italia Argo, which is um, Batman's ex, Batman's ex, and had a baby with Italia Ogo. So yeah. But yeah, it was a great episode. It was amazing, fantastic, and brilliant at the same time. Directed by John F. Showalter, written by Beth Swartz and Grinna Goodfrey. And yeah, it was a great. It was such a great episode. It was amazing as well, brilliant and fantastic at the same time. I really, really enjoyed it. It was amazing. I such it was such a great episode and fantastic at the same time. It was it was really, really good and brilliant at the same time. I really enjoyed it and I loved how the story went on into it. And yeah, Ray was just peed off because. Um, she had, he had a life with Kendra, and she, he was going to get married with her. Seriously. So, oh yeah, there's Rin. Oh, a little bit of tease there, a little bit of teaser. Yeah. It was a great, it was such a great episode. It was amazing and fantastic at the same time. Still to come, uh, my review of Hollyoaks, um, tonight's Hollyoaks and Eastern Dues, so yeah. And I'll be coming filming the next episode of Lego Doctor Who and um, Flash, Nightwing and Arrow as well. Lego, Arrow and Flash, you know. So yeah. Mm. So yeah. So. 
so anyways but yeah it was a great episode amazing brilliant and fantastic at the same time i really really enjoyed it such a good episode it was such a good episode yes it was 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 sorry but yeah it was great it was such a great episode i really really enjoyed it it was amazing and brilliant at the same time awesome yeah it was so i'll do the synopsis in a minute but yes when we find out that um how did um why did um Snap why did Kronos want it um um snap for yes it was revealed that Kronos was actually um Rory um Ro Mick yeah Mick Rory yeah Rory actually yeah Rory um it was actually Mick um aka Heatwave um yeah I was quite I what oh yeah why does um um snap what why does Kronos want snap oh Rory, yes, aka Heatwave, yes, it was just a great episode, how they revealed it, and that, uh, and it was just mm, brilliant and fantastic, I would love to re write an episode of DC's Legend tomorrow, I would love to, seriously, I would love to write a episode of Legends tomorrow, I would actually do one, <laughs> and send it off to, um, whatever and yeah I would I would love to so yeah so here's the synopsis of um, Left Behind yes yeah hell yeah yes in the next episode the guy the team go to 20 was it um, 20 um, 21 56 I think it's like that. But yeah, so his synopsis of um, Left Behind. Kronos disables the Wave Rider and flees back into the time stream, taking Snart with him. Rip um, is forced to reset Gideon to undo Kronos' sabotage when having le leaving the ship, Templey is stranded in the time stream. Meanwhile, two years pass for Ray, Sarah, and Kendra. Ray, Kendra, Ray, and Kendra um, build a life together and rip. While um, Sarah rejoins from her potential, the League of Assassins, Rip and the rest of the team arrive in 1960 and get Ray and Kendra. And they travel to Nanapa back to rescue Sarah, but she has fully commanded to Russia Gaul's mission and turns the team over him as trespassers to execute. Rip um, acknowledged the trial by combat between and save the team with Kendra and Sarah named as the champion to fight. Elsewhere, Kronos reveals himself to Snar as Mick Rory having been found by the Time Masters and trained to be their bounty hunter. Kendra is able to get through to Sarah and just as Kronos arrives, Raze, Raz frees the team who excessively to stop Kronos and discover his real identity. Imprison him on the way where the, um, the team decides to try to reform Mick. Yeah, it was a great episode. Left Behind. It was fantastic, brilliant and amazing at the same time. So, Left Behind was unmissable, brilliant and fantastic and funny in some places. Um, but yeah, it was a great episode. It was amazing. I really, really enjoyed it. This one was... Um, quite a bit of a good episode it, it was a great episode and amazing at the same time so yeah legends of tomorrow which continues next where um next thursday at 8 7 central on the cnw don't miss it guys it's gonna be a whopper one because they go to um uh, rips time um time yes oh yeah goes to rips time and trying to stop actually not his time band of savage Time, young Valium Savage, and yeah, and going trying to stop Valium Savage forever. So yeah, the verdict of um, Left Behind, I'm gonna give it nine point two out of ten. Nine point two out of ten. Actually, nine point five out of ten because it was really, really good and awesome at the same time. Subscribe for more DC TV reviews like this, and see you in a bit. And you wonder why I'm not doing on zombie and reviews anymore. I'm still watching it, 
but I'm not reviewing it because I have lots of reviews to do and uh, so yeah that's why I'm, I stopped doing my zombie reviews so yeah, hope you enjoyed this video guys please like, share, comment, subscribe and see you later for more soaps uh, for more for more and reviews like this bye guys